you know, I just wanted to thank all of you supporters uh, of me, uh, of you guys in the green wall that supported me. A new phase roster, a new phase team. Have you get? I'm pretty sure the team was just announced, and it's gonna be me, Slasher, Sensor, Aches. Uh, we gave the team an entire year, and for the most part, we were pretty inconsistent. But we stuck it out, and we were trying to find uh, the recipes for success. And we did find it for a few events. But when you're on a team, and you've had success in the past, you're always trying to chase that win. You're always trying to chase that feeling of getting that victory again. And unfortunately, we couldn't do that. So we thought it was best to try something else. And I think a lot of you guys didn't think we thought the situation through. And, and now that we can announce our roster, I hope that you guys can better understand why we did what we did. So the two players that we replaced them with is actually Crim6 and Formal. Personally, I would like to welcome to the team. There are premier and high caliber players that it, you never come across, and if you have a chance to team with them, you do. Pretty quick, Maven. He has a decent chance to clutch a 1v2. He's gonna pick up one kill right there, and he's gonna be able to get oh, he's out. Challenging. He's, he's gonna challenge He's, he's crazy. He's, he's gonna be able to kill oh, him. Here, all get eyes on with J-Cap. Stay on with Crim. Oh, Crim is an absolute god! Crim is a monster! We haven't seen too much of him yet, but he definitely helped Apathy break in for the moment. You see the score basically tied up as we are in hill number two. But really, it's hill three and four as Mr. X and Rambo touched on. I want to see who is going to get there first. Slasher just trying to hold it down. Fantastic shots. Going to find another player. Sensor in the mix as well. Look at these two opening up with 18 yeah, kills. Combined. Ace trying to get the contested piece and jump straight towards nice. the one. He gets the kill. It's nice. Another up. Ace with the two piece. That was massive play from him. You know, every time he looks at that scoreboard, he's going to see Ace above him. He's going to be desperately trying to catch him. That's just kind of play a crib. He picks up one. He's going to find a second as well. Nicely played from him. Third player is going to be on the hill. He's going to try breaking himself. Back in the lead right now. Scumpy. Last man up here. Three down for Optic. They're gonna score. Oh. Going so big. Now Optic is spawning here to support. That was an enormous two-piece. That was so big. That's giving up the game in the spawns. Unfortunately, he's not able to find the third. But up the game, he still has control of the hill still. Crimson's gonna try and push up. There's gonna be two for him. Massive play coming out from off the game. He turns around, gets one more. There's gonna oh be one more. Surely no, please no. Crimson's is playing out of his mind. 43 kills already, Pumpkin. He is going nuts. Last time we checked in with him was a minute 30 ago. Since then, he's picked up 10 straight kills. 172, 153. Oh. Off the no. Now extending their lead to 20 points. This is unreal play from off the top this hill. They're keeping the contestants high, oh, man. You know, Crimson's absolutely turned up. Turn around.
your formal? I mean, do you wait for the plant and then try and react to it, or do you go hunting? Formal's very, very patient play. You know, he, he's going to be thinking about this, but Aix is going to be chasing as well. Formal's done himself a little lap, but this is so clever by Aix. I mean, you see on the top left of your screen there, <laughs> she plays at the opposite side of the map at this point. Time to clutch up for both players. Bob down, they know where each other are. And we're gonna see Eggs just try and sit back, force Formal to come to him. Yeah, Formal, 34 seconds. He has no overclock available, but does have two grenades. Eggs is gonna be very, very close. Did Formal spot him? Aix no, but Aix first did. First fire. Eggs has fired his weapon. Come on, we got the kill! No, Formal Aix can't finish it. it! It's Eggs! Eggs! Eggs picks up the kill! With the satellite drone. Control, he's gonna go for the one point play. Surely no, he's gonna go straight for the two point play. Oh, oh! he gets it! Grim6, that was Potentially. so great. And it looks like this one not gonna go in this Grim time. Is there, Grim, Grim is there, Grim is there. Grim two, Grim he's got it, here comes the slam. There it is. Luckily gets alive and does a smart play, throws it out about the turns and burns on Slasher. Nothing he could do. Pass that to Grim6. Yep. And Krim. Can he try and get it? Scopes in support, this could be a two-point yeah. play! Up the game, he goes to the lead! 30 seconds Last left. 30 seconds Two players on the Sentinel squad there, Ben. It's gonna be Aix, Aix on the sideline drone. Can he get away? No, he can't. All up the game he needs to do right now is waste the time, and they will force a game number five. Scopey's over there. Crim6 is gonna have to backtrack, though, because, again, it's gonna be all over. Nadeshot has the drone, just waste time. Nadeshot gonna try out. and toss it out. 10 more seconds, it's gonna get reset. Double nades out for Scopey, more grenades coming from Grim. Optic holding on. Three, two, one. Oh is going to pose at game five. Oh my god, what a How much of a talented player he is. But on the other side, Slasher, 10 and 6. What a performance he's put up in this grand final. Eggs, an 18-time champion looking for number 19. Optic trying to get their second MLG title. Sensor going to lead with some nades. This is very risky for Sensor. This is such an aggressive push on defense for Monty. It really is. They are not messing around whatsoever. Sets is pretty much in this corner. So it's just, look at how aggressive Monty can be. Eight. Not really up to much. Sets is going to go for the challenge. Not going to get the kill. Grim bolts in his back, trying to stay alive. Sets is going to get him. Sets That's a huge kill on Grim6. Time is ticking away. And Sets is just completely baiting out Optic Gaming here. The crowd chanting Doug. Shots going down, no one dying. Sets are backing up to some support. That was a huge play for Slasher. Has gone down, that's Nature with the kill. Three versus three, time is ticking. Oh, Sensor! He's just gonna kill from game by a second! Sensor! Unbelievable play! Now he's Nature, one of three. He's gonna get the kill though. 29 seconds left. Bomb down, can he stay alive? Nature now! They win the championship! Oh, I'm so proud of that. We have so much adversity. We won a bio lap up. You guys don't understand how bad we are at that man. We, we came out, we beat him on it. Uh, we never won in the sense it's yet. We still haven't won it. But on the team, when it came down to it, we won. And that's all that really matters. And I wanted to give you guys a video kind of explaining a little bit of the roster mania or quote unquote roster mania that happened about a week or so ago. So now we have a full squad and it consists of me, Aix, Parasite, and Slash. Your double XOs and he's okay. pulling out the LMG. I haven't seen formal rock this, so bringing something out for the winner's bracket final. This is the first kill, Nature gets the second formal with two. Instant kills, one on Enable, one on Parasite, locks down the room. And we actually saw Dane Shot pulling out the Amelie yesterday, kind of watching the middle pool. He went down low and was able to do damage, but Formal gonna open up 4-0 using this Thermal Sight. No one's gonna rock cold-blooded here in Hardpoint. It's just too fast-paced. They're gonna want some fast hands action instead. And Formal is abusing them here with the Amelie. His teammates also adding to the kill feed. Nate Shot with three. Formal, though, six kills in your first 40 66? And yep. they could lock down this back hill if Slasher goes off him about. Really gotta give credit to Parasite. The, the job he was doing in right. that garage. Slasher now heating up. He was, I think, 9-7 last night. Last time I looked at him, 17 and oh, 9, make it 18 and 9 on a four streak after that 19th kill. Will he be able to keep it going? Players continuing to flood through the middle, and the pressure is just too strong for Eggs. He's gonna clean that up. Slasher has his A streak locked down. If Parasite's three. Wow, 
bomb down, and we are going to see Krim. He's oh. got to go, Yuju. He's got he it. Oh, Did the defuse go off? No, he killed him before he got the defuse. Krim six just wow. went massive for up to gaming. being set up here from Optic Gaming. Crim6 could have just ran in. Instead, he's waiting on his teammates. Here they come, though. Slasher is going to find Crim in the window, just laying prone. Crim walked right in front of him. Slasher picks up a second, a third player around the corner. He gets the call out. It's Scump. Scump oh, is taking out, and Slasher is melting everything. Right now, FaZe are out slaying, but they are still losing. And, you know, Scump's picking up so many of these gunfights on the oh, hill. He's unable to shred some big oh. kills from Crim, and Formal. Formal's going to break in. Trying to get it going a little bit. 12 and 16, but on a three streak now. Can he continue to string these kills together? Player surge it forward, and he is gonna find him with the headshot. Grim oh. in the kill feed with Nate shot is over right in. I was dead wrong. Aix actually will break in. Slasher with the support with the bow, but no one is inside scoring quite yet. Looks like Aix is gonna jump right back in. We'll take our screen to him, and you'll see Nate shot picks up Slasher. Will Optic be able to break through that? Looks like they're going for a four-man push all through green, but there's a lot of eyes all in this direction for FaZe. So I think it's to stay alive. A little bit longer, oh, he's actually yeah. just picked up two. Phenomenal play from them, and FaZe are coming back into it. 198 to 187, as Aix picks up another kill on Nature. That's a six streak for him. Blades going to be pushing him just from that bottom red side. He's going to pick up another one. That's seven. Oh. That would be eight for to be collected when the assist comes in. And then he's going to pass the problem. That's Prusix now, still the only player on the team with the kill. This video is going to be short and sweet. Um, I don't really have much to say, but I am extremely excited to be a part of Optic Gaming and be their new fourth. He's 
got it. 15 seconds. Oh, my. Sumo with another huge play. 10 seconds left. Drode going to be coming down right now. Slasher picking it up. Three kills in the kill feed. Going in One for pace. One point will win this. One point will win. Slasher no! going to get taken down. Karma with a big base in this series. I don't think there's any question he belongs to some of the best players in the game. You see why he is such a highly sought after player. Everyone fighting for him and all the trades are going down off the break. Formal oh, no. clearing the Fight way and straight up for the, the front. Time. They don't win these gun battles at the start. It's all game. And the satellite is taken. Karma can't get it out of the map. It's tossed in the back of the phase base and Optic Gaming will be crowned your UMG California champions. Yeah, that is such a tough time to beat an OT. Optic putting all the pressure on FaZe. FaZe not able to They've got pretty good control now, but everyone flying in. If they can kill one more rotation of FaZe players, they should be able to get a pretty good lead here. Yeah, they kill another you know, wave of FaZe players. They have got a pretty nice lead. It's going to be Karma and Krim in the kill feed. Krim starting to heat up. Three kills. Yeah, I'm right. I'm I'm a that's the first time you've agreed with me, man. It feels very, very good. But here we are, 2 I had a second guess myself a few times before I did. <laughs> Just over 30 left. Karma lighted up with the two piece, able to take control of me. Everyone's shooting and moving. The difference between you know, what's, when it went on in Cali and what it looks like might go on today is that you know, <laughs> everyone from... Everyone. All right, well, they've got a couple kills. They are so close to putting pressure into the base base. You've got them spawning out of green. They've got to get forward, trying to control the base. Oh, oh my God! God! Helping! Karma with the oh, four my. piece. He is absolutely a monster. Are the points going to come with it? It's not worth it. Did you just find with that mouse? So strong. Yeah, Formal's going to be really strong with the mouse. Gump's going to push in the hard point. Get one. Going to pick up a second one with Hoop. Players pushing to his right. 13 seconds left on this hard point. Optic Gaming. Want to, sorry. Want to force if you're Optic Gaming. Hoop on your screen. Going to have one player from him. Able to take him out of the face. Going to be able to hold those spawns. Krim wins a big gunfight in the hill. This is gone. Oh, wow. Shots from Hoop just obliterated through Krim 6. And now FaZe looking to try and lock down this hill of Hoop on a 3 streak. Looking for the full. Not going to be able to hear soon. Optic Gaming is going to open up the plug. They're going to take a mass. The bleed. So oh, five and nine dear. for enable. Oh dear. The Formal just turns the birds out of it. Mind don't like Grim stays around the hill, picks up those big gunfights. Gonna be looking to see how he plays the rest of the series. Krim picking up two. He's gonna get taken out. Five. You don't win the gunfights on rotation. I mean Krim picks up a two-piece, and you know the rest of your teammates don't do anything. Then you're in such a difficult spot. I mean Scum picks up two, formal with one. Now you're gonna end up getting almost no He's time. Boost jump over. Gonna try and see if Formal can pick up one. Kook gonna get killed. It's gonna be a 1v1. Slasher against Scum. Oh! The king! First. In this search to destroy, you do not want to go down 3-0 in the best of seven, knowing that there's respawn right around the corner. Zuma jumping forward off the break plane, very aggressive, is going to get first blood. Bomb carrier spotted, Krim6 is going to lose that fight as well. Zuma opening things up here for FaZe, and he's going to find a third. And there it is, FaZe. Let's let know the flag is going to be returned. A big play comes in for FaZe, and that was Zuma, who just directly jumped on the flag, but with 36 seconds, Zuma making a huge play in the enemy base, looking for a three-piece, has him weak. Sasha's pulled the flag, Zuma with a third, can he find the fourth? Zuma, unbelievable play from him, trying to chase down Krim6. The flag has still been pulled out by Sasha. He's away with 24 seconds, they need to kill the Optic flag carrier. Yeah, FaZe needs to just flood the Optic base, Slasher. Thinking about going back, trying to challenge that player, I think he probably had to at this moment in time. It's going to be Optic just playing defense around Crim6. Crim6 going huge here in the last 30 seconds. It's oh, with the kill, no. not able to get a return. Nobody in position for phase, it looks like, Ben. And that is going to be that. Optic Gaming, back-to-back -back X Games gold medalist. And then individually, man, where do we start? A year ago, you take gold. Season one MVP, season two MVP, countless victories in between. Is this the best Call of Duty of your life? Oh, yeah, this is the best team that I've ever had Call of Duty. Where is your cap? Is there a cap for this team? Are you just going to win forever? That's the plan, hopefully. All right, you hear it here. That is the plan from Optic Gaming. They have looked so strong. Back-to-back -back gold medals, back-to-back -back golds for Skump, the first individual to do that. Amazing stuff. I'm sure you guys knew the sequence of events happened that me and Attach released Cap and Chris 
uh, after X Games left the Nile looking for two, and then me and Attach went over to FaZe Clan to join Enable and Zuma over there on their squad at FaZe. Major gunfights happening on those long range engagements right now. The spawns in favor of Optic Gaming, but FaZe doing a fantastic job of pushing them out. Now, again, you have to talk about how is Optic Gaming going to come into this hot depth. I think a map like Solar Hubway is definitely going to be an advantage to them. We've got to look at how warm. Oh, Attach with a nice three. Look at the third. Attach not going to be able to get it. You have to look at the commanding lead. Unless all this is going on, as you mentioned, you know, and Enables just sound a half Oh, oh Clayster! The headshot on Formal. Also, the assist is going to come in. As Formal slaying over him. Now, I'll take a shrine amount of comeback. Surprise is down at this point, but it's going to be able to pick up one. That was Enable. Uh, kills coming in. Kills in the face. Coming in. Jumps up the half point. He's going to actually trying to make the attach in. And he does just that. Peeks back in. He can move. There's the kill. Now, can he get the kill on Top Cat? Of course he can. That's Enable. Scum be heating up. That's four successive kills for him. And enable oh, out to grab a huge round for him. And then what we dream is just one of the ones we want. And we'll make three, two, 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 three, Jumping down, but Karma's on a four streak right now. He's starting off this final as well. And it's actually probably the best event I've seen him play with Optic Gaming thus far, right? I mean, you know, he's had some up and down performances. I think Damon would even tell you that. I think so you can count this one as an up. I mean, so far <laughs> at this event, even speaking with T before this matchup, he thought this is Damon's best event with Optic Gaming. Don't think you can really argue that that much. Outside of the comeback uplink games, hasn't really been too stellar on that one. No, it certainly hasn't. Just been playing the objective more than anything else. Formal, though, is 5-1. and one. Still putting the hammer down. Optic Gaming have came to play at the, the beginning here. 36-1 to one They already. don't like to rotate early. No, they like to take a lot of the times on these hills. They like to just force those gun engagements on that oh rotation. Oh, my so goodness. So some things change going in FaZe's favor. This one, though. Criminal 1 versus 2. Can he get the second player as well? Oh! Cryptic will crunch it up! Oh, my goodness! Cryptic says no! 6-0, oh, baby! As we jump on board into this hub point straight away as Formal will take down two members already. Going on board with Formal as he opens up here. We're going to see exactly if this is going to be his big map. And this kind of plays out just like how the first hard point on Solar did, right? I mean, if Optic's able to oh, take a wow. ton of time, they can afford to just milk that garbage time on some of those other hills. Really put oh, in a difficult spot. Slap down I mean, Karma had a great M8. Then even in Ghost, I mean, we didn't so, see a lot of it. Optic, if it doesn't work, you don't have to really go back oh and fix it. God. It's Take about it even, guys. You guys are arguing over nothing, to be honest with you. Well, you know what? Speaking of the devil, let's go on board with Formal and see what he can do here. Currently 88 to 35 in favor of Optic Gaming. They really need to start thinking about turning this around phase. They don't want to go down in the second set of rotations and have that kind of mental block where you have to play scrap time or worry too much about your rotations. Just play your own game. But Formal continue to open up here. Three streak, four streak for Formal now. Looking for the oh fifth. Gonna just take down Kreiser as well. And he's continuing. He's gonna have another push up top circle. Can he see him or will he get pushed down? No, cut timing doesn't matter. Picks him up anyone with hit fire. Looking for a touch. Has to slap in a new clip. Still alive, Formal. Six streak for him. Sometimes a player just heats up and he starts to just absolutely crush and Matt Piper, at least, nope, probably on top, probably gonna text me some mean stuff after this, but 
formal 21 and 9. The guy just an absolute freak on the sticks. He certainly is. Well, Kleister is now trying to do the same job as him. He's picking up Krim as well on a four streak himself. Turning around saying if Formal can do it, I can do it too. Watch this. However, time for Money Hill. Infamously hard to break into. Will be in terms of phase, but they do not have the rotation for Money Hill. This could be critical. First break could mean absolutely everything here for phase. Coming in, it's going to be Zuma. Can Zuma do anything here? Looking for a player downstairs. Not able to get him. Scumpy's picking up two in the hill. Crimson's still on the hill. He's picking up another one now. Optic Gaming are looking to shut this down right here and now, and they just have to hold to do it. Attach though, picking up kills. Yeah, and he's going to have teammate support on the back stairs. That's going to be Enable and Zuma picking up kills with the battle. Zuma watching the front, Enable watching the back. And this is going to be a whole four phase. They are only down by two seconds here, Bryce. It's going to be challenge from the front. Oh, Tash attach. picking up huge kills. It's going to be a tie game. 20 seconds left. Up to getting control of the hill. Phase need to break it now. This would be a huge win for them if they are able to jump in and break this one. Scummy gets the second, looking for the third. Not able to pick that one up either. And I think it's all done. Just about held it out. Opti Gaming almost threw that one away. Yeah, a lot of rounds that work. Things were something unconventional. And I don't really worry about going to pick up one, though. Huge play right there. Yeah. So we're trading away again. You better put advantage of Phase. Now it's a two versus two. Zuma and attach. It's a 2v1 action, right? It's going to be hard oh, now. And that's it. And that is it. Two back to back championships. No. What's next for you guys? Uh, how about three? Does that sound good? As they continue to hold this lead. Indoors is attached. Attached gets one. Gets a second. He is starting to. The second sub for this Optic Gaming squad. He is really struggling. Five and twelve has not been able to get anything going quite yet. But Nabel, we gave him flag for his performance a little bit earlier against Epsilon. Look at his numbers now. Twenty-two and eight, making twenty-four wow. and eight on a four streak. He had a six streak earlier in this game for one of the fastest players in the game. It's uh, something that we don't see too often. Fantastic plays coming out of the touch so far. He's on a two streak. Looks oh man, uh, so far double. in this game for FaZe. You've seen some big plays from him in the garage. Now he's going to win the fight up top. Great shots with the foul. Picks up one. Challenging formal. He's going to pick up a Picks second. Picks up a kill as well. Scum doing everything right. Crim6 now feeding it. Gets one, gets the second, and the hard point. Still possible. Yep, still possible. And Scum is inside. They can't allow any oh, that's contesting. Contest, though. And here it comes in. The player taking care of him real quickly. 13 seconds on your clock. They could the tie this. Crowd they is could still tie this. They could still tie this. If they hold every single second, I'm pretty sure they could potentially tie the game across the time. Karma's in. They have the contestant that comes in right at the very end. Is it enough? It is. They take it by one point. A massive contest for the Really, just patrol that area. He goes down. This first, is he really going to get another one now? Finally, yeah, Clay cleans that one up. But this first match is huge for Optic Gaming. They, they need to win it. It's, it's a must win for them. They do not want to allow FaZe to get momentum. Because if they get momentum in the second best of seven, then that's when you're going to see this FaZe team get very, very hyped. I would love to see this go the distance, though. How about Attach opening up 5-0 and, oh and collecting 32 points and counting here for FaZe? That's Six. the momentum. Optic Seven. Gaming oh. needs to stop the bio. That's what they're trying to fight towards. 
Ioneski's green plants. We'll try and cut a couple of kills off. But you know, final lap, half point, first couple of hills, doesn't really matter what the lead is. It all comes down to that third half point, that bloody hill, blue hill, you can just completely change. And I want to give big props to Chris. Three streak finally falls. The tank on a six streak down to 15 and 9. What a half he's had. Can he pick up another kill? The assist comes in. He's still on the half point now. He's jumping up and down. Plays them with great support and range with that assault rifle. This is what makes Faze such a dominant team. It's very much like off the game. Right when Pomo is going to be He's going to spot players in transition. Going to be on the long flank. Sloppy shots out of corner, but he does settle down. Picks it up on a naval trip. Six feet well. Takes care of business on attach. Two players inside the hard point. Karma looking for the new spawners from Faze. Going to find Zula. Didn't see a player directly to his left, but it's going to get almost a three piece. Honestly, you got optic members in position, but Faze is just shooting so fast that their reactions are oh ridiculous. One and another wow. big win by Attach. Looking for a oh, second, he's gonna find 84 to 39 now, and growing is the lead oh, for FaZe Azuma. Drop shot battle, Scump's gonna win this one. Scump with the two piece finally breaks the hill, but there's only five seconds left. So you see a 50 point advantage and growing here for FaZe. Scump and the crew need to get inside. Krim is gonna be there, Scump helps out. The window shut down, Scump now on a spree. Eight kills, but four of them have been strung together. Can he keep it rolling? Looking for his fifth. Going to connect with the fifth. Scumby tries to reply to uh, an able streak with one of his own. Looking for more. Oh, oh my lord. Scump, that's six in a row. Looking for seven. Gets the seventh. Scumpy lighting up the main stage right now. Phenomenal stuff. He's going to have a tough time here, Ben. And oh, my Clayster. Please show this to me one more time. Five more, says Clay. Five more rounds. And they will be season three champion rounds, and it's been the sniper. Clay's gonna get aggressive, oh and he's oh gonna connect. Was even at formal. Karma jumps across and is gonna get. That's another monkey that you get off your back. That's the biggest back one. You just have to string Can another five on top of it. Throw them all off. Let's go over <laughs> to Optic Gaming once again. Pressure is on them. Stump off the break. You see his route. We'll take a look at Karma, and here's formal bottom bit. You see the train coming through. He's setting up, and it's going to be Zuma punishing Karma on that perimeter. Scumpy does pick up the kill, though. 3v3, Krim trying to trade the kill. He's been counting. There's so many explosive battles. He does manage to get away. Two versus three, though, in favor of FaZe. Formal sneaks behind one, makes it a two versus two. Formal and Krim going up against Attach and Zuma. 56 seconds left in the round, and Formal is being desperately chased. He needs to be careful here, because both players from FaZe are right on his tail. Formal surely dead to rights attach. Oh, don't get turned on. Surely oh, not. No, picks up the kill now. All of the crew. The shot card, a 1v2. 39 seconds remaining. Krim is going to get finished. FaZe will take your season three championship.
Jesus for 